With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello guys, in this question we have 50 ml of 0.5 molarity of oxalic acid is needed to neutralize 25 ml of sodium hydroxide solution. Right. The amount of NOH in 50 ml of the given sodium hydroxide solution is. You have to find out the amount of NOH solution which is present which can be present in 50 ml of sodium hydroxide NOH solution. So basically we have to find out first we have to find out the molarity of the sodium hydroxide solution for from this equation. So as we know oxalic acid what is oxalic acid? Oxalic acid has the formula oxalic acid is C double bond OH uh, not not like this this will be like C double OH C double OH so this is basically H2 C2O4 right now uh, let's write the equation here so the equation is oxalic acid is reacting with sodium hydroxide so oxalic acid is H2C2O4 plus 2 times sodium hydroxide I am writing this equation uh, the balancing balancing I am writing the bal balanced equation so here this will be Na2C2O4 plus 2 times H2O right so as we can see here if this react 1 mole of H2CO4 if this is uh, reacting 1 mole of H2CO2 C2O4 then it needs 2 mole 2 moles of sodium hydroxide so now first we will find out that how many moles uh, of H2C2O4 we have for this equation for this question. So we have given the volume and the molarity of oxalic acid. So to find the number of moles of oxalic acid we will write a formula which is moles of oxalic acid moles of oxalic acid will be equals to molarity into its volume. So we will write here molarity multiplied by volume but uh, please keep it in mind that volume will be in must be in liter so here molarity is given we have 0 0.5 and volume is 50 ml so to convert it in liters we will multiply this by 10 to the power minus 3 so the moles of the oxalic acid is we have 25 into 10 to the power minus 3 moles right now we have 25 in test for minus 3 moles so it needs 2 times of the moles of this so we need we need 2 times uh, we, we need number of moles we need number of moles of NaOH equals to 2 times of the moles of oxalic acid so this will be 50 into 10 to the power minus 3 moles here right now what we have to find out is first the molarity right so to find the molarity we will again use the this formula same so we will write here molarity is equal to number of moles uh, number of moles divide by volume volume must be in liter yes so number of moles we have is 50 into 10 to the power minus 3 here 50 this is minus 3 right 50 into 10 to the power minus 3 moles divided by what is the volume given for the annual is 25 ml here so this is 25 which is will be in 10 to the power minus 3 which will be in liter so molarity of the annual will be 2 2 molarity molarity here we will write molarity of NaOH right so now we got the molarity here and now we can find the amount of NaOH so in amount of NaOH in 50 ml so to find that we will again use a formula a basic formula of molarity so we can write molarity is equals to this is volume will be same number of moles moles we can write it weight given mass upon me number of uh, given mass upon me molecular mass so here we will write molar mass multiply by volume which must be in liter right so we have molarity is equals to 2 weight we have to find out 
its molecular mass molecular mass of naoh molecular mass of naoh is 40 uh, 40 right so this will be 40 multiply by volume volume is 50 ml here so we will just put the formula here we will just put the value of uh, value 50 and which must be in liter so multiplying this by 10 to the power minus 3 here right now after solving this this will be 4 by 20 and this will be 4 4 g so the amount of nuh in 50 ml of nuh in 50 ml 50 ml of the given solution will be 4 g so this is answer thank you for watching best of luck bye bye For class six to twelve, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.